guys, the THP plays here. Uh, sorry if I sound like this. It's because I'm really annoyed. Two people. Yep, two people are doing this. So let's do a little bit of uh, you know, a story time. This is gonna be my first story time. So it all started when me and Justin wanted to get like um friends. So um, he met a girl named Icy, and um, we started being friends, you know. And then I kind of um, Justin wanted to ask her out, so I asked um her if he if she liked him it took like an hour for her to reply back because she didn't you know didn't know she's like oh i don't know then she said yes they broke up after three hours and this is honestly kind of both of their faults first um j um why is because justin kept killing her on gta but here's the thing you're you can't like why are you gonna dump him just because of that and um um, then after that, once they, like, broke up, um, that's when it was my time to ask her out. We dated for about a week. Well, she, yeah, she said yes, um, we dated about for a week. And then, and then she ended up, um, well, first it was me and Jimmy. We were playing, um, we were, like, gonna do pranks on her. I was acting like I was mad at her and I had her muted even though I didn't. And I said to her, um, um, I said to Jimmy, say, um, to her that I said, um, that I don't like her. And then we kept doing, like, pranks on her, but then this is the one that she broke up with me. I, I said, Jimmy, ask her if she likes you and she'll dump me for him. And I acted like I was gone and all that, um, even though I wasn't. And then that's when bad stuff started happening. She said yes. I deleted both of them. And Jimmy, I, well, I didn't delete Jimmy. Um, the next day when Jimmy, um, I told her, because she didn't know that we were breaking up, even though I'm pretty sure I told her. She didn't know. Um, then um, after that, I said to him, go to her. Act like you want to date her and get her mad or something and then make her break up with you. That didn't work out. He betrayed me. He's like, you know what? Um, at the last second, he's like, you know what? No, I'm just going to date her forever and you can't do anything about it. Next day, they broke up. Icy friended me back. Um, She ended up like... um. She ended up like um, dating someone, um, dating uh, Connor, one of my friends. You haven't seen him in video yet, um, and started dating him. He's she's still dating him at the moment. But what just happened? Of what like I just deleted. Um, I'm gonna delete IC after this. But so I did a little prank. Um, I forgot to tell you guys. Usually when she's like bored, she's usually mean and I don't really care. I might leave the party and be like, you're mean and then just join back for a joke. But here's the thing, I was just bored and I like being mean to you when I'm bored because you know, in school when I'm at Carline, I'm really bored. So I just like make fun of my friends and all that. Uh, they get, cause you know, that's what good friends do. <laughs> um, she started, um, and then, um, I said to her, oh, you're so weird. And then she left. She's like, you're mean. She left the party. And before, she called me sensitive a lot. And then she started like, because you called me, um, you called me weird. And I'm like, dude, you're really sensitive. Like, you don't see me doing that. Um, You don't see me saying that when you um, mess around like that. And then uh, she left the party again. And she's, I'm in a party right now, but she left it again. Um... So Jimmy is on her side now and I'm calling him a sex offender because he's he's offending male because he's only on her side because she's a female most likely because he's been on her side. But you know, I don't really care because I don't need fake friends like them. Like, why do you need fake friends when you have freaking um freaking Justin, Gangsta Kitty, Noodles, um, and all, and all my best friends. Like, why do you need them? So, yeah, that's a, 
uh, story time. Since you know this was kind of short, I'll do another story time right now. Um. Anyways, anyways, anyways. Um, going back all the way to 2017. I see. I'm not. No, I'm kidding. I'm not. I see. Um, me and my friend Gangsta Kitty, we were looking for girlfriends because we have been single for like um, three months. Well, that wasn't for me. Him, he's been single for like freaking two years. Um, oh frick, I have no ammo. And we went to this community called Dating Community, and she, um, we found two girls. The names was Jen Martin and Dan Jen. Um, and uh, so we were like talking for the first day a lot and then I was like, yeah, um, you have a good day. And then I left, I went to sleep. Next day, asked her out. Um, well first the um, Gangsta Kitty did and then I did after. Um, so, um, Dan, um, she, he ousted out J Dan Jen. Oh, and also I forgot to say, we actually lied our age. We said that we were 13. Um, we said that we were 13, um, even though we were really just 10. Um, um, Dan Jen was 13. I mean, Dan Jen acted like she was 13. She also lied too, just to be friends with us. Um, Jen Martin, she was actually 13. That's the girl who I went after, because I liked her. So, we, we, me and Jankster uh, gangsta struggled. Who are we gonna ask out? Am I gonna ask out Dan Jen or Jen? And then he's like, you know, I'll just ask out Dan Jen. And I was like, mm -hmm, okay, you can ask her out. And um, she said yes for him. Um, Dan Jen said yes. Then Jen, I asked her, she said no. She said she already had a boyfriend and I left and I cried. I was really sensitive back then, like really sensitive. And I left the party, I started crying like a lot. Then she invited me to a party and said, I actually, I love you. And well, and before she said she already had a, bo a girlfriend, a boyfriend. So she said, um, she said, I actually, I really do love you. And then I was like, yeah, yeah. And then we started dating. Burr. Oh, frick, oh, frick, oh, frick, oh, frick. I have no ammo, I have no ammo. I'm dead. This is the end, this is the end. This is the end. This is the end, I'm dead. Um, anyways. After, um, was when, when, um, it was about two days after we were dating. That's when she said, um, that we were doing a prison break heist and that's when she said, she already, she lied. She just wanted to make me feel better that she already had a boyfriend. And here's the thing. She called me, guys, guys, look, me, not a man and I need to grow up. I'm like, girl, you're 13 and you're lying to a 10 year old and you're calling me um, that I need to grow up. You need to grow up and act like a 13 year old. And then we really never talked, and yeah. Anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys later. Um, if you guys want a video with them talking to them about it, or next video, I actually have something you know special. It's gonna be a review on my favorite movie. It's a superhero. He's armored, and he goes against Eric Killmonger. Kill, Killmonger. I'll do a review on that if we get at least one like on this video. Anyways, anyways, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed that video, and I will see you guys next time. Stay a T-boy. Peace.